gents, welcome to a special video. Today we are at a TTC 100 event. I absolutely cannot wait. You guys already saw how many um, freaking old vehicles are displayed over here at uh, TTC's own uh, Hillcrest complex. Dude, I can't believe it. Okay, uh, I gotta be careful about the copyrighted music. God damn it. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And uh, yeah, I'm not gonna talk too much. I'm just gonna show you guys some really cool B-roll shots of this event. So yeah, let's get it. Alright ladies and gents, it was a bright and sunny morning here in Toronto and I am just super proud to be able to join in on one of the festivities to celebrate the TTC's 100th anniversary. Wow, what an accomplishment for such a vital public transit agency. You guys can click the link in the description below to watch a video made by the TTC's own YouTube channel to look back at the TTC's fun and interesting history for the past 100 years. But anyways, the TTC opened up their Hillcrest Complex for this fun and interactive event last summer. This complex is located near the intersection of Bathurst Street and Davenport Road, and is known for being the TTC's largest facility. Since 1924, this place has helped the TTC store repair, and maintain most of its bus and streetcar fleet. It also has admin offices, a transit control center, as well as a small network of tracks that connect to the CP tracks located on the south end of the facility. During this day, members of the public can come from afar to gander at some of the TTC's fleet of vehicles. This is the event for you guys to take a look at their buses and streetcars old and new. It was an incredible sight. The complex, now bustling with transit fans young and old. Once again, super excited to be here for this event. Now I was actually informed by a few of my transit friends on Discord about this, as well as hearing about it on TTC's social media posts. But yeah, I think this is just about all the background information that you guys need to know for the event. And so let's get back into talking about what I filmed that day. So just by the guest entrance, you guys can see some booths that were set up. You guys could either buy TTC merch, grab some of those awesome paper models, or take a look at various showcases on sustainability and TTC's look into the future at these tent areas. And now, please take a look at these walk-around shots of this Wheel-Trans Accessibility Vehicle. Our next stop in this awesome lineup of TTC buses will be the TTC's Vintage GM New Look. The New Look class of buses had also been nicknamed the Fishbowls. Man, those were the good old times, like back in the 80s. Wish I could have experienced that for myself. Oh yeah, I should probably mention this, but I really appreciate the TTC for making events like this so interactive. You guys can actually go sit on the driver's seat inside most of these transit vehicles on display. 
Of course, many people are gonna have fun honking and fiddling around with the controls. In the end though, it's all fun and games until some people in the transit community decide to escalate things out of control. And now, let's take a look at the Novabus LFS HEV. Now of course this is one of the more common bus models you guys will see running around right now on the TTC network. Next up, we have the new Flyer Excelsior XE40, one of the first battery electric buses in the TTC fleet. And people are already starting to play with the route destination signs. Alright guys, apparently they ran out of bus paper models and they just they're just giving these ones away. These ones, they said apparently are old ones and are extremely rare. So wow, I feel bad if you literally can't grab these right now. Oh my goodness guys, the um cutouts and paper models over the, at the uh, event they are incredibly fragile so i came up with a strategy and that is to go to a nearby drugstore and ask for a freaking plastic bag and surprisingly they didn't ask uh me to pay for it which is really nice but yeah let's um continue on with the video all right and we're back and yeah, as you guys can see, people are already starting to play around with the route destination signs. But anyways, let's go ahead and take a look now at the next two buses that are displayed here at the event. The TTC surprisingly decided to show off three of their brand new electric buses that are now being introduced to the fleet. Oh, and here's a sneak peek of the streetcars displayed over there. Now, let's take a look at the interior of this Proterra Catalyst BE40. We should ask <laughs> 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 And finally, here's the BYD K9M. Okay, I think at this point, I've already started talking to some other transit fans who are enjoying the event just like me. And so I decided to join in on their hilarious antics. Yeah, go Raptors! But now, please enjoy a compilation of some of the hilarious things us guys made the buses show up on their destination signs. It doesn't work. It doesn't work. No, it doesn't work. It doesn't work, it just, it just shows like, it just shows like... Oh my god, why'd you change it? I was gonna take a picture of that. <laughs> <laughs> Mission! Yo, you guys changed it! I was gonna take a picture of it. Go to the X. Oh no! Dude, it says Aquatic Center
No, no, no. Dude, dude, look at that one. Yo, dude, look at that one. It says... Thank you. Greedy three, what? Yeah, seriously, what the, what what the hell is the window doing? Who's even doing this? I honestly didn't think anyone would try that before we started the LMS hybrid. Why? Who keeps doing this? <laughs> what? What? I need this point. Don't change it. I need that. Yo, I need this point. Got crazy. This is too good. I, I am going to like post this all over Discord. I swear to God. Please. Wait, what Discord do you? Happy bird of Corp. Runny meat, runny meat, short turn. Support Block History Month. <laughs> Get a photo of that. Oh, three. I got it right when they came. Over Avenue. Show me the picture of that 200 one. I didn't get it. Why? What? Donald's Express? I'm sorry, what? Express Network. Express the Lions Down Station. I want to express the Lions Down Station. Man, that was fun. But yeah, we decided to move on to look at the streetcars, starting off with the current Flex of the Outlook. <laughs> wait, wait, dude, 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 press the bell and then the horn. Hello? Yep. Alright, good. There you go. 510 Spadina to Spadina Station. Next up, we have the freaking CLRV. So happy to be on it again. Yo, so we should film this. You guys are watching this show. Film it. Film it. Film it. Film it. Film it. I'm voting, uh, no, wait, hang on. Uh, I'm running for mayor of Felder for the city of Toronto. Please accept my ballot. No, Toronto, take a picture. Um, vote for me. Otherwise, <laughs> the Lorax will not be happy with you. <laughs> Alright, I realized I didn't film enough of the CLRV at the event, so shout out to my friend Sam for letting me use this footage for the video. Wait, hold on, I just want to record the... the... Wait, wait, move your head. Get to the yellow ones, I know they don't have anything on here. Okay, thank you. You have to start at the very bottom of that one. Well, let's go. Is it on reverse or? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, it's starting to die down now. I think because the event's almost over, that's why. Oh, oh, that's a good shot. I like it. All right, last but not least in the event, we still need to take a look at the PCC and Peter Witt Street cars. This one, the PCC, or President's Conference Committee, was built and produced around the 1950s. And this streetcar is the small variant of the Peter Witt streetcars. These were produced in the 1920s. Now these two streetcars had been wonderfully restored to now become part of the TTC's historic fleet. And by the way, I have seen these two streetcars run before during one of the annual Toronto Beaches Lions Easter parades. And so it was certainly amazing to finally be able to take a look at these two beautiful classics up close for the first time. 
Wow, what a great way to look back into history. And like, these old streetcars have such comfortable seating. It's crazy. And we're back on the Flexity Outlook with some friends for more fun. Wait. I've seen them on videos and I'm like, wow, there's people walking down the street and the car is literally being like. So yeah, at this point, we're pretty much just walking around to the different vehicles once again, talking and just having fun. What's in the fire <laughs> extinguisher bin? It's a, it's a mystery, no one will know. Press front! Press the door button! Oh, it's the front! Go! Hey, yeah, let's go! Oh, No one close. Let's go, bros. Oh, I'm loving my 5% battery. <laughs> <laughs> Contact, so we can... Yeah, that's true. We can I have no life. I'm always available. <laughs> <laughs> Me too! Well, ladies and gents, and that will just about do it for this TTC 100 event. Yeah, it is way past 2 p.m. so the event's already ended. Oh man, we had so much fun today with friends and on the uh, vehicles that TTC has brought out for us. Oh man, I'm really gonna start to miss this place and all the fun we've had. That was amazing, but yeah, really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Yeah, like the video, comment down below and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll be seeing you guys on the next video.